Spatial neglect is an inattention. It's really the brain's inability to pay attention to a certain side. And that's really gonna make a big impact on how they're walking. They will run into you, push you out of the way, and not even notice. Most patients that we work with, they have right brain stroke, they're neglecting or they're not paying enough attention to the left side of space. They feel normal, they can talk to you, but they're not initiating movement toward the left side, or they could see everything, but they are not perceiving everything. Treatment that we use called prism adaptation treatment is a method to assess how they're performing in real life tasks and then a method of training them with optical prisms. Really my whole hobby was cars. That's what I did. I had my own auto repair shops. I drag raced. That was my hobby. That was relaxing to me. <laughs> People thought I was crazy, but I had fun. And uh, in 2009, I went to sleep and had a massive stroke in my sleep. It was just workaholic. Working with someone like Bob was great because he had a lot of drive and determination and he, he was able to maintain his sense of humor through a very, very difficult time. And I think that that really helped him rise above. He was always willing to try things. I hope people learn that there is spatial neglect. I think that if we could have all stroke patients have access to these treatments of assessments so that it could be identified, they could start to resolve it instead of just kind of living with it and not being as successful as they could be. So Bob, what we're doing here is those goggles are helping shift the image more toward the right and it's causing your hand to have to make an adjustment when we take the goggles off, we should see your hand move more to the left. Uh, some of the activities you did was, uh, well, you had to wear the goggles. It's forcing your muscles to change and do what they have to do. But it was just really weird wearing them the first time. You have to get used to them. It was, it was fun though. It got me out, it got me an hour a day in the thing. It was working out. And after a couple of weeks, I saw it started helping me. I, I think one of the challenges is that other therapists very often believe that they know whether someone has neglect or not, they will treat the piece but not the whole. So if we aren't treating underlying cause of all of those problems, I don't feel like we're really giving the patient the service that they deserve.